Here's Master Teague. He finds the edge, turns it up. Master Teague, burst of speed. Master Teague, touchdown. Boy, how about that? I thought this game was your coming out party, man. Um, I thought this was the game where we got a chance to learn, you know, about Master Teague. How big was this win for you guys, man, getting past Indiana? Good win, a big win. We did probably respect them throughout the week, made sure we were prepared for them. They weren't going to give up, and they didn't. When you guys turn on the film and you look at Indiana, you see all the different blitz packages that they gave you, all the different, you know, disguises. How difficult was it, you know, preparing for a defense like this, you know, for you guys as an offense? That's probably the most I've ever had to, you know, study and, and just prepare for that, something like that. But like every play, they was bring some heat. So it was definitely a challenge, you know, and that's one of the parts of game is running back. You know, you really have to uh, just continue to improve. You know, they brought some stuff uh, that I never seen before. Your offensive line did such a great job at just creating a wall for you. Um, Jeremy Rutgers blocking his butt off for you on the end. You're tied in. Chris Olave out to the left blocking. And you got even Garrett Wilson screaming down at the, at the back end. How big was the ground game for you guys in this game? It's always big in every game, man. And, you know, it was very exciting, um, you know, to have that experience. And, uh, you know, now we got that taste in our mouth. You know, we don't want to let that, that taste go. You want to keep pushing forward, keep moving forward with that. Um, like I said, on that play, that was uh, a great, great design, great blocking everywhere, great effort. Uh, you know, all I had to do was, was follow my cues and get upfield. So that was, that was amazing. I want to transition to another play that I thought was one of your best plays. There is a saying for running backs, it's speed through the hole, not to the hole, right? So that ultimately that means it's just showing patience. This is a power run, I believe. And, uh, you know, so I was just following my cues and, and I saw that little hole. You know, I squirted through there as fast as I could. And, uh, you know, when you're going fast, uh, it helps you to uh, break tackles, break arm tackles. And, you know, I, lo I love running downhill. I love running downhill. So, uh, you know, with that, you know, guys in my way. So I'm just, <laughs> just going to run through. And this is what I love right here, man. You got four four down linemen, uh, two, two linebackers in the box. So you basically, in the pre-snap, you're running against six. Michael McFadden drops out. Um, so you end up running against basically five guys. But I thought this was, you took advantage of this opportunity. Because listen, if y'all gonna play the pass, right? If y'all gonna drop back out and, uh, you know, try to stop Justin Fields and our receivers, um, this is where running backs can really uh, leave their mark on the game. What do you think the biggest misconception about your game is? You know, this is something that, you know, I haven't been able to show as much, but, you know, I'm a home run hitter. I, I, can, I can break those home runs, you know, I got the speed for that. Uh, so that's, I think, one of the things that um, people don't really notice or haven't recognized. And, uh, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm trying to show that more. So, and I think as you get rolling, as we have been getting rolling, uh, it's gonna, it's gonna show in my game. Because um, you know, I, you know, I, I can, I can run, I can run fast. One of the fastest players on the team. So. I can definitely show that. How do we not fall into a trap game against Illinois? Where do you guys feel like you need to improve? You know, I think we bring out good, great energy from the start, uh, great energy in the, in the uh, first half. But we just need to finish games out, and that's what we've been, you know, trying to work on this week. How can we do that in practice? Being intentional about every rep, uh, all the way to the end of practice. You know, uh, just keep the energy going. So I think we have to come out and respect the team. You know, they've been known to to have some upset, so we just got to make sure that, that we're on our P's and Q's and we just finish out the game. Everybody sees you guys as their Super Bowl. You're not playing whatever that team's record is. You're getting the best of them. Um, good luck this week against Illinois. Keep toting that rock between the tackles, man. And um, we'll see you guys at the end of the season for sure. Yeah, I really appreciate it. Uh, thanks yes, for having sir. me on. Great talking yes, to sir. you.